few main spots that I've been going to catching fish for years now. First, this is the boat launch. Ah. fish around anywhere pretty much around the boat launch. Um, there's a road behind the boat launch here. If you keep going back behind that road right here where those cars are, you can park right there and do some really good catfishing. Um, right here. There's a dam right here. Um, right there. And it's pretty good fishing catfishing, um, striper also, um, it's decent fishing right there, but if you, uh, keep going this way where the metal bridge is, right here, there's also, uh, a lot of good salmon fishing right in this area, um, you could park right over here, right in this area, right here, park right there, and then you just walk over down, there's a little sandy area down in here, that's pretty good for uh, striper and salmon, and then if you turn left, come on the bridge here and turn left on this road, and keep going all the way, this is really good uh, fishing all along here too. Anywhere you could park, you could fish anywhere along here. But if you keep going, we'll uh, go to First Beach here. And First Beach is a really good spot for uh, striper, sturgeon, um, bass, pretty much any fish in the river. So here it is right here around this turn. And then you can see a bunch of sand. <clears throat> These pictures are really old. Uh, Don't think that if you're looking at this that it's a picture yesterday <laughs> or even a year old. These pictures are really, really old. So here's First Beach and it's super good fishing there and right over here is about 60, 60 to 80 foot hole and I've actually caught a sturgeon right here before um, it's really really good fishing um, depending on what time of year you go there but if you keep going keep going on the road past there keep going around these turns and right here is second beach as you can see all these trailers here um, it's not like that anymore it's completely all cleaned up and it's a lot better it got pretty bad at one point I didn't even want to go go over to Knight's Landing because all these homeless people were living here and completely ruining the river um, but thank god they're out of here now so it's all clean in there it does not look like what it does right here with all these campers and stuff yeah it doesn't look like that anymore it's much cleaner so third beach is and there's also spots all along here too you could uh Anywhere where you could find safe parking, you could fish anywhere along here. And make sure it's not posted. So keep going. And then right here, there's a big turn, and then it comes over here. And this would be Third Beach. You can't really see it off the road. Um, so right when the road starts going away from the river, right here. And you could park anywhere, anywhere right around here. So you could park right here. Uh, this is pretty good parking.
parking all around these areas right here. And this is super good for uh, sturgeon and striper. Um, you can do nighttime fishing here. Uh, or uh, any time of the day, really. So. That would be pretty much uh, the main spots. There's also before before Third Beach. There's a little spot right here. Sometimes you can get, depending on the water level, also uh, that has a huge factor on how much of a beach there is at these places. Um, like Second Beach was pretty small compared to how it normally is because the water is pretty high right now and it's really dirty right now once again because um, all that rain we just had but the sturgeon it is pushing the sturgeon up the river so Wow.